We had had the opportunity, of course, going into this whole district-wide building program to think about at elementary level, what did we really think about elementary learners, their classrooms, how classrooms have changed from the time these, you know, 60 to 80 year old buildings were built. There were some things that were consistent across all the buildings, but something that was kind of unique about the challenge at Armstrong. We weren't tearing down every wall, you know, building a whole new building, but we wanted an opportunity to transform that space as well. And also that it be, you know, kind of timeless. This was a moment of time where we were going to be able to do some really exciting things design-wise, but they were gonna have to last because the building that we were in had lasted us for 60 years and we may not have another opportunity to do something significant for, uh, you know, at least a generation. It's very common to see teachers having kids work outside in the hallway. And so they were already constrained by the limitations of the four walls of their classrooms. Our goal really was to create some spaces within the building which were destinations that would really make a teacher say, something special is gonna go on there. And kids would be inspired when they go to think in different ways about their learning. So that's where we started. And as we thought about that, that took us in a different direction. I spent some time doing my own research on Visioneering's website and said, well, what if I just picked up the phone and called and said, you know, do you do any work in schools? And I found out, yes, they, you know, Visioneering has done educational spaces. And then from there, Visioneering really helped me think through how do we get the process off and running. As a kind of a turnkey operation, they could help us at any stage of the process, whether it was just the process of imagining what we might really want in a deeper way than I had already thought, or, or really walking us all the way through the process of, of construction. When we worked with Visioneering, they came to us after listening to have, you know, a great idea. We ended up with three spaces and a great concept for three designs. And to watch that unfold has been, it's just been a great process all the way throughout. And the spaces have ended up being just exactly what I would have hoped for. To see that kind of from discussion phase, to a sketch, to working out details on such a scale of inspiration. Everything from the colors, to the flooring, to the lighting. It's an amazing space, so even down to those details, you know, Visioneering has helped that kind of concept, you know, come to life. And it's built so that kids can kind of climb up in the clouds and read a book. I found that Visioneering was an organization that thought about place in very intentional ways, on a level of inspiration that, that is just, you know, beyond and so we're grateful for all the partners that um, helped this process come to life.